how to fix g++ fatal error no input file hello guys welcome back to a new video today i will show you how you can fix g++ fatal error in your windows and pc as well guys laptop right now if you are facing this type of issues like g++ fatal error then let me know in the comment box today i will show you and i will tell you the few method that you have to apply your problem will be 101 percent fixed let's get start that what's the first method in order to fix this problem in your windows and pc you have to simply open this search bar in your windows after opening this you have to type run once you will type the run you have to click on the enter button next what you have to do in the search bar you have to click on this big space and now you have to type ms info 32 you have to type this one ms info 32 after it click on the ok button when you will click on the ok button it will show you like this type of interface now what you have to do you have to select this one system summary after typing this system summary you have to see scroll down and it will show like here you have to find bios mode so this is our exactly bios mode that it is right now on uefi so make sure you guys you have to turn these settings into the uefi if you have not turned into the uefi then please guys you have to keep your bios mode on uefi next one is scroll down and you will see it will show boot secure state secure boot state so right now this is a disabled and off so you have to turn on yes guys you have to turn on this setting in your windows and pc so right now guys i will turn on so that my problem will be fixed so now what you have to do my next method that go back and again click on this search bar and type run when you will type the run again click on the enter button next you have to back up and type local app data so right now guys you have to firstly give percentage local app data local app you will see guys so simply guys you have to choose this local app data after that click on this ok button now you will see there there is a lot of settings and files has available here in these all files guys you have to find g++ fatal error file so you have to choose that and you have to uh, remove previous file and reinstall the file and second one is that you have to clear the catch of that file this is your second method now uh, our third and final method go back and before telling the third and final method please i am requesting to you guys please if you are watching my videos at first time make sure guys you have to subscribe our channel as well hit the bell icon so that whenever i will upload any video you will get instantly the notifications of my video let's move on the final method our final method that you have to go to this windows click on these settings in these all settings you have to find the windows update tap on this what you have to do next you will see result go back again click on this windows right now guys you have to check on this window update so i will click on this window update so right now my window already has been up to date it so if your window has been not up to date it, then please you have to keep your window up to date it yes guys this can be reason that your game and this this type of error is facing right now your windows so you can check that your window has been up to date it or not if not then right now immediately you have to update your window so guys this is a today's solution of this problem i hope this video will be very helpful for you don't forget to subscribe this channel see you in the next video guys thank you